Popping everybody, it is wetness day or Wednesday. It's kind of shitty out, it's kind of pouring out. So, I am sitting waiting right now to meet up with my buddy Brian because he's kind of selling off some of his collection and, um, you know, needs money for some things. And, uh, you know, who else better to call than me to buy some grails? So, I'm waiting on him. And then as soon as he gets here, you know, me and him will do our thing. And then I will show you guys what I got. So, again, I hope everybody's having an awesome Wednesday. I'm trying to stay dry out there. And, uh, yeah, so I will show you guys what I get from Brian when uh, when he gets here. So stay tuned. My man, Brian. What up? My man, Brian. Coming through with the grails like a mofo. Always, man. Always gonna come with the grails. So, just wanted to get get Brian on camera real fast. Say thank you for the grails, bro. Always a pleasure. And then as soon as Brian steps out, I will show you guys what I got. Yeah. All right, everybody. So last night when I picked up those pops from Brian, it was dark out. The lighting was bad, so I really couldn't show you guys what I got. So I just wanted to take a quick moment while there's light out to show you guys. So, first off, my man Brian comes through in the clutch and hooks me up with OG Aquaman. So, this is the original, original Aquaman. This thing is awesome. Brian's got grails for days. Um, you know, he's trying to get into more of the, the music, the music stuff. So, um, you know, he's getting rid of some of this stuff so I got this from him OG Aquaman and then the other DC eh, grail I guess is the original Hawkman so we got the original Hawkman this thing is awesome so I'm only missing um, Martian Manhunter Green Arrow and Sinestro and I have all the original DC Universe Pops. So, again, thank you, Brian, for both of these. They are awesome and super excited to add more Grails to my ever-growing Grail collection. So, thank you, Brian. I appreciate that. And then, uh, yeah, so I'm going to go inside now. I'm going to go home and relax for the rest of the night. And then... Tomorrow is Target Con. So I don't know what you guys are hoping to get. I know what I'm hoping to get. If you want, comment below. Let me know what you're trying to get. Um, as far as what I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get the Wayne's World 2-pack. Um, I'm trying to get the Darth Vader. I'm trying to get the Michael Jordan. And um, maybe the Captain the Captain Marvel. But that's, but that's really about it. So I will see you guys tomorrow morning, brain early, when I'm standing outside of Target at the ass crack of dawn. What's popping, everybody? It is Saturday, day after Target Con. So I hope everybody got what they wanted. Um, I appreciate everybody that left the comments on the videos. Um, you know, there was uh, mixed reviews. You know, some stores got some stuff, some stores didn't. Um, you know, some stores were letting people take more than, than, than one per you know, per one, you know, one per a, uh, you know, specific one. And, uh, you know, I know the one that I was at was letting people take two of each, of each one. Um, but, but yeah, I know some people didn't get what they wanted and some people did. And, you know, I feel bad for the people that really didn't, you know, it should have been a fair thing. It should have, you know, Target really needs to understand how, you know, really one per customer is, is the right way to go. And, and that should have been a universal thing all the way around, so everybody could have at least had a shot at getting getting what they wanted. Um, you know, but man, people were double fisting those Jordans and, and the, the Vaders, so, meh. But again, I feel bad for the people that didn't get one, I really do. Hopefully Target does a 
restock and you guys are able to go ahead and get what you want and um, you know rather than have to go buy it second hand because we all know how much of a pain in the ass it is to go buy stuff second hand so with that being said the week started out so good so I got those two grails from my buddy Brian who I still can't thank enough he's such an awesome guy and helps me out you know well, I help him out but well, we help each other out again that's what the community is all about helping helping one another out <coughs> so I got the uh, just a quick recap I got the OG Hawkman and the OG Aquaman I need like I think like two or two or three more of the old old school ones and then I got I have all the original ones which is great because all of a sudden I find myself becoming a completionist which is you know something I don't do I usually just buy the ones I like but to each his own so but I am on the road right now I am on my way up to West Palm Beach we are going to Comic-Con Revolution so this is a Comic-Con I've never really been to I don't know how big it is so I'm, I'm super excited I know there's gonna be a bunch of people there I'm looking forward to chatting it up with a bunch of guys you know that I know they're gonna be there so I'm super excited about seeing them and uh, yeah so I will hit you guys up once I get to the con and looking forward of course to finding some pops so I'll see you guys when I get there I knew this morning when I woke up that something marvelous would happen and look what happened it's the marvelous night what's up guys it's early doing doing con MCE style yeah that's true we're gonna con out <laughs> so all right so we are uh, <clears throat> unfortunately <clears throat> We've got to go to our office real fast because something happened last night that I need to go check out. Plus, my Captain Marvel pop box is sitting there, which I definitely need to get that. And then we will be on our way to the con since it's literally eh, maybe right down the street. So, again, marvelous stuff is upon us. We are heading to the con, and we will see you guys when we get there. All right, we are here right now at the Palm Beach County Convention Center. We are getting ready to go inside, but... We've got to tackle the line first. <laughs> exactly. Thank you. It's like at Disney, it's the line ride. So we are going to go inside and then we're going to have some fun. Oh, we are so worthy. Why did it track you? I don't want it to track you. Press passes. We're going in. Let's go. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh, thank, that's what she said. Thank you. All right. So we are in here right now. We are looking and... Oh, this thing is just so awesome right out of the gate, the golden idol. Oh, the fertility idol. I think you could use that, no? So. We got a whole bunch of mystery boxes to start out, but we're going to start walking around and uh, seeing what we can find. We got some comics over here going right now. It looks like it's pretty, pretty decent sized convention. So, yep, we're going to walk around. Eek, somewhat. Got, looks like we got video games going on over here. This cool man got some old PlayStation 2 games. Oh, snap. Got some Atari stuff. Look at this, man. The original Defender. Air Raid. Look at this. This is awesome. Freaking asteroids. Oh, snap. George, look. It's Qbert. And we got some pop figures. But it doesn't look like anything I'm interested in. And black ass anime statues and George's block of my view. That's freaking bad it. I like these these Hot Wheels. Oh, I'm dropping stuff. <clears throat> you gotta buy it. No, no. Make him buy it. Look at that man. Drop it. Freaking Batmobile is pretty dope. The older ones. Ah, the classic one. Adam West. Tumblr. Nice. You got the penguin oh, I got the penguin duck from uh, Batman Returns. Oh, and the Keaton Batmobile. Nice. Cool beans. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't know. Were they weird wizards? <laughs> Alright, so 
Oh, dude, look at that freaking power glove. <laughs> oh, man, that is dope. So, we got some pops over here. But got the Hobgoblin. He's got a Speedy Gonzalez. He's got a George Harrison and a Ringo. He's got the Metallic Dragons for Game of Thrones, which is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, I kind of want that Hobgoblin. Uh, I don't know. I might come back. I might come back. I want that Hobgoblin. Some comics going on right now. Wolverine's kind of cool. Uh, that Captain America's cover is dope. Uh, so much stuff already I want to buy. George, there's so much stuff I want to buy already. Oh, dude, that Spider-Man 2099 right there is dope as shit. That's pretty cool. I like that. Um, oh, yeah, that's the J. Jake, 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 Jake Jake Scott Campbell. Campbell. See ya. the first appearance of uh, Carnage. See, if you hang out with enough people, you, you, you'll learn a thing or two. And I'm learning. <laughs> All right, now we're talking. Now we're talking my language. How you doing? Good. How are you? Mystery boxes, ten bucks. Come on. Okay. There's Funko exclusives, Mickey's, um, ad icons, two chases, the targets from yesterday. Cool. He just got a Funko exclusive. Nice. Yeah. Jordan from yesterday. Yeah, you can go on. Oh, okay, perfect. Thank you. So we got a bunch of Dragon Ball stuff. Got the Conans. That is the littlest camera I think I I've know. ever seen. Oh, what it, is that? This is called the DGI Osimo Pocket. Because I used to record with my phone, but now I, I use this so it shoots in 4K and everything. So, That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's really cool. And then, you know, like it does a thing where. I flip it around, it follows me. Oh, and that's really cool. Yeah, it is. Can you, does it have like apps and stuff for like your phone? Yeah, you can actually plug, there's like right here, you can actually plug it directly into your phone and then you can actually use the phone or use this oh. together, so. That's pretty cool. Funko, the Elvira, Bigfoot with the marshmallow. You a you vendor or a club? I am actually a YouTuber. Oh, okay. So this is, our, this is my personal collection. Oh, these are okay. My well, these are all my doubles. Is is it, do you have do you have a store, or you yeah. guys just do your no, own? It's actually me. Oh, okay. Well, let's They're see. All mine. Oh, okay. Well, let's yeah. see. Um, Pop Gal collectibles. Pop Gal collectibles. Cool. Yeah, so these are all my doubles. Uh, it's cool. So we got some statue stuff going on over here. Got my gallery pieces that I do have quite a few of. It's awesome. That venom is dope. Got a 10 inch Hulk. They got the, the 10 inch Green Goblin. Like the Star Lord. Yo, huh. Before we get too much into this, we need to figure out um, about Chris Claremont and Don Cage. Okay. Got some Funko Pops over here. It's pretty cool. Oh, we got a Chrome sighting. I love Chrome! That's cool. He's got some decent stuff. Alright, well. We got some comics over here. It's pretty cool. Hey everybody, look, it's just Josh. Just Josh. Just Josh. Just Josh. So, all right, we're going to go. Whoa, look at this thing. That is freaking dope. What is that from? Um, I know he's Egyptian. Well, clearly. Hey, would you say he's walking like an Egyptian? <laughs> 
So we are now watching the longest credit card processing in the history of credit card processing. This is this is this is this is this has been going on for at least I don't know maybe five minutes already. <laughs> so clearly the service in here isn't that great. All George wants to do is get in there and see that. So wait, do I have to account word yes, do, check do, account? And it seems you know, I should be bringing the cash. <laughs> Do I have to pray to the credit gods <laughs> to let this process? Credit gods! Process this shit! So we are looking to see what we got. I usually take a hair dryer to make like 20 minutes so it's really soft. It's, it's cool. Got a, oops, sorry. Got a lot of the end of the box figures. A lot of cool stuff. Oh, they got, I don't know if you guys can see it because it's so back there. But they got a Batmobile from Toy Biz. That was like one of the original ones that I had when I was a kid. That was so awesome. Got a whole bunch of figures. That's cool. That is dope. Oh my god, are you serious right now with this? Does it still work? No. Ah, I would totally buy that if that still worked. Now we're talking the Mecca Wall O Pops. Oh, this is cool. Uh, it's cool. They got some really cool stuff I'm seeing right now for all my Dragon Ball friends out there. We haven't, I don't want to get a big cat. Exactly. exactly. Just, 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 oh, my yeah. anime yeah. piece. We got some Attack on Titan. I'm disappointed because it's been two months right now. Exactly. And the car tractors and the city, they're going to push them back. Oh, man, that is cool. I want that. Uh, and it's got the San Diego Comic Con sticker on it. All right, I might have to get that. I might have to get that. Got some Stan Lee's, Orange Deadpool, I got Orange Deadpool. I've seen so many things. I don't know the official name. They got the uh, Bruce Lee's. We got the regular Flash. Oh, Miami, okay. Yeah, I'll get it. Look, Jasmine. Yeah, they got some cool stuff, man. That's cool, the Green Hornet. Ah. Uh, all right, I might have to go and get that green that green goblin. I think I might go get it. How freaking awesome is that? I just met Ming Cheng from Comic Book Men. Just walking by, he was cool enough, nice to take a picture with me. He even said that we can actually go over there and um, actually do an interview with him for the channel. So I think we're going to go ahead and take him up on that, which is going to be freaking awesome. So stay tuned for that, guys. So I am here with Mugaku right now. Thank you. I guess I can derelict my own balls. Thank you. Yeah? All right. Thanks, man. If you can. <laughs> if I can, that's true. All right, and we are walking around. Still checking out some stuff. Yeah, I see some pops coming up right now. Let's see what we got. We've got Captain America. Got the Hot Topic Girl. Got some cool stuff over here. We just bought that Venom and got it signed by Donnie Cates, which was freaking awesome. Such a nice guy. He's got the Chuck Norris box, White Tiger Zord. Got some other stuff over here. Well, nothing that I haven't seen or already don't have. So, all right, we're gonna keep looking, walking around. There's so much stuff. There's so much stuff to see. We've got more pops over here. Let's see if we got anything cool. Excuse me, 
Paris coming through. Oh, snap. Look who it is, everybody. Look who it is. It's, my press pass. it's Captain Puerto Rico. What's going on? Oh, Captain Puerto Rico. Where's George? He's in the CGC line for Donnie Cates right now. I've missed you so much. That is sick. And now we're going in here and we're going to check out some pops. Let's see what we got. What do we got? Let's see, we got some chasers right off the bat. Got some, got some really cool stuff in here. Got some really, really cool stuff. So. Alright everybody, so I'm finally here with my man Vince, just a geek from the 305. If you guys haven't already, please go follow him and subscribe. His mystery boxing and videos are the shit. I will leave the link below in my video so you guys can go check out his channel. Please go check him out. He is the man. Thank you, brother. Of course, Appreciate man. It, That's what we do for each other in the community. Appreciate it, brother. So, you find anything yet? Not yet, not yet. I just got here. I'm going to go walking around a little bit. Nice. A lot of cosplay, though. A lot of cosplay. There's Very a lot cool. of cosplay. Very All cool. right, so we're going to walk around, and I will see you guys later. So me, Vince, Chris, Chris, we're all here. We're going to open up some mystery boxes, which is something I don't do. That's my man Vince's thing. But you know what? I was like, you know what? Screw it. Let's have some fun. So, all right, let's open up some mystery boxes. So you go for middle first. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Go for middle first. All right, so we've got a 2018 summer convention. Imperial Trooper. Okay. Come pop, on! Pop God. Pop God. We need the pop gods. We need the pop gods here. We need the pop gods. I need the power of the gods. Next one. We got 8 bit Leonardo. Leonardo. Come on, man. 8 bit Leonardo. Okay. Alright. I got a feeling the last box is right. the. Let's do it. Let's do it. I got a feeling the last, the last box is the winner. So we're gonna open up all three at once. Ready? One, two, three. George Jetson. George Jetson. Eight bit Jason Voorhees. Hey, not bad. Awesome. Okay. I'm going Mega Ball. I'm good. With Hence the time. reason why I don't do mystery boxes. <laughs> I'll let you stick to your thing. Yeah. I'll let you stick to your thing. I'm only, I'm only doing this for Vince. So. Well, sure. All right, everybody. I'm freaking exhausted. Um, I had such an awesome time today. Um, that interview with Ming, uh, meeting up with my man Vince, just a geek from 305, and his wife, and uh, you know Chris and the other guys. So that was uh, that was fun. Um, bumped into a uh, co-workers brother-in-law which was real which was real fun he was a cool guy so i'm glad i got to meet him and uh yeah man i mean i'm freaking exhausted i'm ready to go home um i got some really cool stuff that i'm driving right now but i'll show you guys when um when i get home i'll show you guys the uh the two things that i got that were funko related that were really cool and uh yeah, that was a that was a fun day at the con, man. I gotta t I gotta tell you that was uh, that was the most fun I had in a while. So I'm heading home right now. Oh, it's so bright! So and I want to give a special thanks to Barbara and her family, um, 
her son and her daughter are like the nicest kids ever and they're really sweet kids um, the mystery boxes that I had bought um, I gave to them because you know I know they're Funko fans and they watch my show so you know I like to do stuff like that for kids especially um, because I like to encourage I like to encourage kids to to collect to find the hobby you know and it doesn't have to be that hobby but just to find the hobby and, and a lot of people seem to find find this fun because it's something that they could do do with their kids too I mean I do it with uh, you know I do it with Ethan so it, you know it's fun and her and Barbara and her husband just the nicest people and and again I couldn't thank them enough for coming out hanging out so you know we all really had fun today collectively as a group oh man actually you know what can I grab no nah, I can't grab that stuff damn I wanted to show you guys what I got so just bear with me I'm gonna get home I'll pull in the parking lot and then I'll show you guys what I got and then obviously we'll call it a day so I'll see you guys in a little bit all right I'm finally home thank the pop gods I am exhausted what a day so now that I stopped, I can show you guys what I got today. So Nowhere Comics actually had a, um, a booth there. So I was like, wow, so let me look around and let me see what I can find. So come to find out, they've got the Glow in the Dark Green Goblin San Diego Comic-Con with the San Diego Comic-Con sticker. So I was like, holy snap, I've been getting one in this one for a while. Even better, because it had the con sticker on it. So that was a plus the other cool thing that I got was when I was actually um, interviewing uh, Donnie Cates he had a um, the Venom Pops and you can get it signed so I bought the Venom Pop and you can see that he signed it right there I don't know if the lighting's that great but he signed it and I put it in a put it in a soft protector so but it'll go in a hard stack now this is um this is awesome. Um I I'm, I'm glad I got to meet him. He's an awesome guy. Um I did an interview with him which was really cool which you guys will check out once that goes up. But the extra extra cool thing was is that I got an alert that a package was delivered to my office. So of course since my office was right by the convention, I was like, "Eh, let me poke my head and let me see what it was." So for some reason I thought it was my Captain Marvel um uh, Marvel Collector Core box, but it turns out it was something different. So I got the box right here and, oh man, come on, come on, get out of there. Ugh. Look at this, look at this thing. So let's go ahead and pry this open and see what this is. Oh, I know what this is. I know what this is. Ooh, ooh. Oh, come on, come on, Alpha Papa. Oh yeah, this is the Amazon exclusive 10-inch Giant Man. God damn, this thing is huge. But man, that thing is awesome. Holy cannoli! So oh, man, this thing is so awesome. This thing is so awesome. Amazon exclusive. So. Got another 10 inch pop to add to the collection. So guys, that's gonna wrap it up for Saturday. Um, and then we'll pick it back up tomorrow and uh, see where I go from there. I did see a lot of Hot Topics getting that, um, that Golden Age Batman. So I'm sure I'm gonna have to go hit up my mall tomorrow and see if there are any left. If not, shame on me, but I don't know. I felt like I had to go to that con. So the con was a little bit more important in my mind, but I need to get that pop. So again, I will see you guys tomorrow and uh, we'll go from there. All right. So, so much for resting. I'm walking into the mall right now. The wife and the kids wanted to get out of the house. So I was like, all right, I can rest tomorrow and not do anything, but I do have to come inside and find that Batman. So that's what we're doing right now. So we're gonna go on a hot topic. Um, FYE GameStop and uh, hopefully they have them so we'll see what we got all right we're here at Hot Topic let's go inside and see what they got all right there they are this is awesome golden age Batman so excited pop gods so we got this and let's look around and 
see what else they got. Okay, so looks like they really redid the wall a little bit, which is pretty cool. So let's see what we can find. So see they got Head Cemetery, they got Hulu Lilo, they got some of the men in black ones in. They got the 40th anniversary alien, which is pretty cool. They got the uh, gold chrome Doctor Strange. What else do they got? <clears throat> There's more Mrs. Nesbitt. There you go, Vince. They got some cereal for you, buddy. We'll get you. We'll get you to eat that cereal just yet. We got the glow in the dark Stark. We got Waddles. We got Dean. What's this? We got Sabrina. We got some pop stacks. We got a bunch of. Pez, we got the Dumbo box, they still have some of the Lilo boxes, some of these Crunchyroll ones. Uh, so much stuff to look through. Uh, I don't care, I got what I came here for. I got the Batmans, so, all right. All right, so I got the Batmans, so let me go ahead, let me go pay for it. And uh, we'll go hit up uh, GameStop and see what they got. All right, walking into GameStop. Let's see what we can find. All right, so looks like they got it too. But again, it's a common, so I knew everybody's going to have it. They got Game of Thrones. They got the Jim Lee Batman. Pick it up. Let's see what else they got. Now they got some of the newer Conan ones in. Hey, Good Freddy. Mr. Hanky. Ralph. Oh, they got the uh, Conan O'Brien Luchador. We got the Jeffersons. We got loaded with these Conan pops. I haven't seen this one before. This must be a new one. Uh, uh, yeah, that seems to be all I see in GameStop. So, all right. All right, so I'm back home now. I didn't even want to go to FYE. I'm so tired. But I did go to Hot Topic, and I was able to get boom the golden age batman first appearance batman i should say which is awesome so glad glad my hot topic had some of these left and yeah so you know i'm you know it's bad when i don't even want to go into a store that's how tired i am so it's been a long day guys um i think tomorrow there's going to be no hunt so it's just going to be a day of rack rest and relaxing and doing some stuff around the house and then i'll pick it back up on monday so i will see you guys then and i hope you enjoyed uh, all the con footage and the uh, and all the other good stuff so see you guys then what's popping everybody it is monday and after lying around and doing nothing yesterday it was fantastic it was nice to have a day off just not to do anything and hang out with the family so of course today back on the hunt so I am going across the street to the target from my office 
and uh, going to see maybe if they got anything left over from Target Con or maybe they restocked. Um, I know the last time I was over there, it's been a while since they restocked, so I'm interested to see what the wall looks like now. So I will hit you guys up once I get inside. All right, I'm here right now at the Funko wall. Let's see what we got. So it looks like we got some squints. We got some Wayne and Garth still left over. Rose and Jack. Got Al Bundy. Got the ten inch headway, they got the toothless They're behind this, so looks like they just got everything pulled pulled to the front. But then I see this. And it looks like they got a whole bunch of them. And that is a cool that is a pretty cool looking t-shirt. Uh, do I want to buy it? Okay, so clearly I caved and I'm going to buy it. So, and uh, yeah. All right, so that was uh, pretty cool. So, I wanted to get this because, not for the shirt obviously, because they don't make this in set size. So, um, but I did buy this in a size that I can give it to my son. And I did like the way the pop looked flocked because um, George got it and showed it to me. So I thought it was pretty cool. So I felt, I felt the urge to go get it. So I'm glad they had these. Um, they didn't have them last Friday when I was at the, um, Target by me, but the Target across from my office still had some, so perfect. So thank you, Target. And that's going to wrap up my hunting video for this week, guys. So I hope you like what you saw. I hope you like the con coverage. Um, again, I'll leave the links below for the interviews, and uh, we'll go from there. So if you guys like what you saw, please give a thumbs up. If you're new, please be sure to subscribe. As always, be sure to hit that bell! So you get notified every time another episode of What's Popping gets uploaded for your viewing pleasure. As always, you can check out all the excellent content we offer at mcecentral.com. There you can find the collecting news, marvelous statues, statue fanatic, that geek show, comic chat with Chad, and me. So until next time, guys, that's what's popping. Mufasa. Say it again one more time. Mufasa. Ooh. Later, guys. Peace,